Hi YouTube friends, Itzy here. I am so sorry that I didn't talk to you in so long. And thank you for all your nice words that you missed me. And Sue, I missed you too. And Cheryl and Michelle, I think. Different people asking where I've been. I've, I've been out for a while. I had an injury on my foot and I just wasn't feeling so good. I wasn't walking very well. And now it's springtime and I'm out in the woods and it's just beautiful and I'm able to walk now my foot's doing really well and I wanted to do a little quick video on the difference between skunk cabbage and false hellebore and they're two beautiful native plants and a lot of people confuse false hellebore with skunk cabbage and I want to show you the difference so you know the difference when you're out walking in the woods the difference between the two so first we're going to pan in on the skunk cabbage and this is skunk cabbage that's what the deer like to eat the deer love I'm, I'm sorry not the deer the bear the bear love it and they eat that when they first come out of out of their hibernation and then right next to it you have false hellebore and false hellebore looks quite different even though it has the same leaf structure as far as the way the leaves come out then the leaves Go in here. I'm going to take the camera here for a second because I want to. I want to really talk about here. You take that. Oops, sorry. So the leaf structure is kind of the same. If you look at both of these plants, the way they come out, they're almost like a rosette, like a rose, the way they come out. But then if you look at the the veins of the of the skunk cabbage, it's much wider of a leaf, and the veins almost look like beet greens or something like that without the red. But then when you go to the false hellebore you have these leaves that have this beautiful their lines that the lateral lines that go all the way and they're so beautiful both plants are absolutely beautiful but when you see them one right next to the other you can tell the difference skunk cabbage false hellebore see the difference there skunk cabbage skunk cabbage false hellebore all right, we're gonna go again and see what you see. Which one is this? Skunk cabbage, right. And which one is this? False hellebore. Pretty cool, huh? So, there's your native plant class for today. You learned today the difference between skunk cabbage and false hellebore. And I really missed you all, and I'm really glad to be back on the scene. Can you pan through the scene in this beautiful, beautiful creek? It's just so nice to be outside. It's been a long winter for me. Usually I go away for the winter and I find myself in tropical places. And this winter I didn't do that. I was having trouble with my foot. I had a surgery and taking care of the foot. The surgery went well, but I had some issues after. And, but now I'm back on my way and I'm walking up to two miles a day, which is really good. And now I had it taken care of during the winter so I can enjoy my spring. So here I am in the beautiful, wow, it's just so beautiful. This is all rhododendron behind me. Can you show the rhododendron? It's just so beautiful. So here I am in the rhododendron forests and it's just amazing here, it feels good. So. Sorry again that I haven't seen you and the truth is boy I really miss doing my YouTube videos and uh, I don't know it's just good to be back so thank you for watching I love you so much and I will see you again peace take care bye